Welcome back, Minimate fans. Today I have a really cool Minimate review for you featuring Marvel vs. Capcom 3, Fate of Two Worlds, Deadpool vs. Dante. So this is a really awesome two-pack, and I knew these were coming out, but I wasn't expecting them out when they were, so I picked it up because Deadpool is a popular character and sells out pretty much everywhere you can find and Dante from Devil May Cry is probably one of the most iconic characters from Capcom. So here in the back we have the eight different figures that you can get in this first wave and they're all paired up as they are here. We have Hulk and Mike, that's a, that's a two pack, and then you have Dante, Deadpool, Iron Man and Arthur, and then Magneto vs. Zero. I did not see the Magneto 2-pack. Out of all of these 2-packs, the one that I really, really needed the most was the Dante because I have all the other Marvel figures, um, but Deadpool was just a bonus. So I thought, you know, even though, you know, Dante's not in Marvel, I thought, well, out of all of the Capcom figures from this wave, that was probably you know, the one that I wanted the most, and Deadpool, I was like, oh, that's awesome. So, very cool bio down below. So here we have Dante and Deadpool out of the packaging, and you can see here we have some accessories that you did not see in the packaging right there. We have Dante's sword, which is really awesome. I was surprised to see that, and I was like, wow, that's a really amazing sword. It's a very unique sword to him. And then we have guns. Well, we didn't have see guns in the packaging, so that. That's really awesome. Dante comes with two guns, and Deadpool comes with his two guns, and Deadpool has those two swords. So yeah, as you can see there, that's really good. The only thing that I do not like about either of these figures, they don't have accessories, like little pieces to hold their equipment. Like, Deadpool cannot have the swords on him. He can either hold the swords or hold the guns or one each. And Dante does not have another spot on his body to hold his other gun. So that's the only thing bad about it, but for the most part, I mean, it's still really good. And if you need a Deadpool, this is still a very good Deadpool. So that's, you know, that's good. And Dante, this is the first Mini Mate Dante, so that's, that's really cool. Dante, here we have articulation arm goes around and then normal articulation here and the head piece you know it's a mini mate this is the sword get a good look at that really awesome articulation on the feet you go front and the knees there's the waist um, like I said it's a normal articulation it's gonna be hindered a little bit by this uh, trench coat but you know looks really awesome uh, they did the slits here to make the you know you to be able to move the legs a little bit better than in normal. So that's really good. I could take everything off, but there you go. Get a good look at Dante here. So then here we have Deadpool, and this is the other two swords. I'm not gonna you know equip them, but you get a good idea. This is what the suit looks like here. Looks pretty good. The belt is a little bit more added to it, but not a whole lot. Like I said, there's no place like a holster for any of the guns but you know you got the articulation of the arm you can bend the hands rotate waist rotates legs you know basic mini mate so I mean it's pretty cool I really like all the accessories that both of these figures have and hopefully um, if this is something you like you pick it up so thanks for watching my review on Marvel vs Capcom 3 Dante and Deadpool